Today we shall reflect on the life of Saint Vincent Pallotti. He was born in Rome on the 21st of April 1795 and was the apostle of the Eternal City at a difficult period of time in history. He had been raised up to an apostle to undo the spiritual harm wrought by the Napoleonic wars. He is called a second Philip Neri because of his tireless labors in the confessional and the pulpit and his boundless charity towards the poor the sick and the unfortunate to whom he would give away the very shoes and clothes he was wearing having received his doctorates in philosophy and theology he taught theology for 10 years he started his apostolate among students and it soon became clear that rome possessed a holy priest He was made confessor of Propaganda College, the Roman Seminary, and an English college. His influence on all of them was deep. Hardly a waking moment remained unemployed. He went to the confession each day before mass, during which he often had ecstasies, and then began his day's work. preaching in the churches and the squares giving retreats visiting hospitals and prisons and hearing confessions in the late hours of the night vincent zeal embraced the whole world and every need spiritual and material for this universal object he founded the society of the catholic apostolate and the sisters of the catholic apostolate an early realization on his part of the value and necessity of the lay apostolate led him to found guilds for workers agricultural schools loan associations orphanages and homes for girls thus initiating a social program that was later formulated and set forth by a friend of his youth Pope Leo the 13th He died on the 22nd of January 1850 aged only 55 and was beatified 100 years later by Pope Pius the 12th Vincent Pallotti whose body lies incorrupt in the church of San Salvatore in Rome was canonized by Pope John the 23rd on the 20th of January 1963